Hi everyone, Dr. Greg Gillen with Human Fusion. Hope you guys are well. Um, listened to a podcast this morning by the McKinsey Company. It was called Putting Talent at the Top of the CEO Agenda. And I thought you know, there's a couple of things in here that's really, really good. And so this won't take long, but I just wanted to, to, to review this for you. The, the first thing, the, the first concept that they talked about was making sure that the right people at the top were focused on the talent agenda. And they called it the G3 group. So uh, the, the group of three, or the CEO, the CFO, and the CHRO. So obviously the CEO needs to buy into this idea of putting talent at the very top CFO, probably because they're going to have to allocate the funds to get the right people on the bus. And the CHRO, obviously, from a human resource perspective, has to be on board to make sure that we're hiring um, in the right way and that we're, um, you know, we're allocating our resources appropriately. And, and speaking of reallocation, one of the things they talked about was very interesting is that companies who actually reallocate capital every single year uh, do much, much better in the marketplace than those companies that simply take capital um, funding maybe from last year and then add X percent to the bottom line. So companies that really think about how to pull capital, in some cases, from other departments to put them into uh, departments that are doing well, that reallocation of funding. Companies do much better when they do that, more strategically thinking about what they're doing. The, the other thing is that when we look at reallocating people as well. So, so maybe someone is struggling in one area, but we know from their strengths assessment and we know from you know, other, other types of uh, feedback that they might be uh, much better suited in another area. So companies need to reallocate their people as much as they need to reallocate their capital. Uh, quote, there is no strategic plan without a talent plan. I uh, love that quote. And then finally, all leaders should spend some time in HR. Um, I think that's a great idea uh, because if we're going to put talent at the top of the HR agenda, everyone needs to understand how talent is recruited, how it's hired, and how it's developed. And, and the, I guess the final thing that they talked about was that HR leaders need to really become less transactional and more strategic. Of course, things like comp, benefits, payroll, those types of things have to happen. But if you're at the top of an HR department, you're gonna to have to become much more strategic and let the transactional things fall to the delegation side um, of your own development. Hope that helps. If you like management related videos like this, please subscribe to Human Fusion. We'll keep you up to date on all the latest trends that are affecting management and management practice.